welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosell. Today is the 17th of March 2023. So the Jerusalem Marathon is officially over. It happened today. People from all over the world came to Jerusalem in order to compete. The city closes down, which is always a bit of a bummer living here because Friday is really the only day when the city's open, but it's all in the name of sport, entertainment, and it probably brings lots of money to the city as well. So today I'm up here on uh, Bible Hill, which I've done a video of before. Uh, it's a beautiful site, despite the name, it doesn't, to the best of my knowledge, have any connection to the Tanakh. It was so called because they were gonna open a biblical museum here, called in Hebrew, Givata Tanakh. Um, and of course, I would be neglectful not to mention, this being the 17th of March, it's also St. Patrick's Day. So I need to have a uh, Guinness after making this video. Uh, not much really going on in Jerusalem for St. Patrick's Day. There really isn't much of a Irish community here in the city. A few people with UN missions and what have you, but uh, in terms of Irish born Jews like myself, we're a very, very small contingent. What you can see behind me there in the distance is East Jerusalem. And uh, what I wanted to show in this video, fun fact, is that you can actually see Jordan from Jerusalem. On a day like this, on a clear day, if it's miserable weather, it's cloudy, whatever, you can't see it. Uh, but today is a beautiful, clear, sunny day, as I hope you can see. And you can see behind me there, that is East Jerusalem, Jerusalem over the Green Line, the eastern part of the city. You can kind of tell from the building structure. Just over there, if I just pivot the camera a little bit, is the Mount of Olives, which you can also see all the way from across the city here. I'm on um, the Givata Tanakh, as I mentioned, Bible Hill, that's just outside if you haven't been the uh, first station complex, the Mount Zion Hotel is just over here. Uh, just a few minutes walk outside the old city. If you have a dog, you wanna walk your dog somewhere with a bit of greenery. It's one of the few real kind of open green spaces in the city, of course. There's parks like Gansakar, but this is kind of a little bit more rugged. You have here the Scottish Guest House. St. Andrew's Church is a church property and there's actually some ancient biblical burial tombs uh, dating back way, way, way in history just in front of those as well. Uh, so you can see Jordan from Jerusalem and uh, the marathon's over and we're getting ready for Shabbat in Jerusalem. Thanks for watching uh, today's video from uh, Bible Hill here in Jerusalem. If you have any uh, ideas for places I should go and check out you'd like me to visit in Jerusalem or Israel, drop me a comment. Thank you for watching uh, this video.